Let's see if I can get killed by these birds. I'm betting I absolutely can. Oh yeah, birds will kill you. Excuse me, birds. Do I go this way? No. Nope. I want to go this way just to get the fucking birds off my head. Okay. This goes outside, right? Uh, yes. All right. Sounds about right to me. Let me check the map. See where. Oh, we're at. you are in danger, sir. Okay. I gotta turn around. Go to the hallway. Straight to the right. And. Uh, don't be afraid of shooting them zombies. I you will. Are, like, Absolutely one not. Hug away from death. Oh, but I love hugs. No. Oh, Limpy. Oh, yeah. It takes so long to raise his gun up, too. Yep. <sighs> Sorry about that uh, pause and talking there. Yeah. Weird burp I had to take care of. I don't. I can't. I can't burp like that. Like, like Dash. I'm kind of. I'm kind of jealous, to be honest. I need soda to burp like that. I haven't seen Dash drink anything but water, like the majority of the time we record. So how he does it, I don't know. Shoot the fuck out of that zombie. They take a lot more bullets than I remember them taking. I he seems like he's dead. Yeah, he's he's dead. Fucking onion shit. You know what? I feel like there's a safe room. Yeah. Within my grasp. That one right there. I'm gonna dump this crank? Crank off and grab my jewels. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> that was overly sexual. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Did somebody say grabbing my jewels? It's <laughs> <laughs> a great accent for that. I had, a, I had a character for that that uh, was... Uh, how do I want to describe this? He was like a German... The character that I created to use this voice with. I'm going to say this just in case. Good idea. He was like a like a film enthusiast. Okay. And he would respond to like uh, I never got to use it for anything. It's just me talking to myself. But it was like responding to people complaining about I don't like Star Wars, the new Star Wars, because there's there's not enough straight white male characters for me to relate to in it. Right? Because you, you hear that. Sure. And then he would say, Oh no, please. Shows you feel out there and your butt's a movie hurt you. <laughs> that, that was the extent of the character. It's good though. I like it. This is a good accent. For, uh... <laughs> Here's Ooh. where I die. Yeah, because I think there's a liquor in here. I think there's... This is... Oh, this is the tiger eyes. Yeah, this is where you use them and then the liquor is going to fall through that uh, 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 skylight thing. Oh, man. Nothing. Oh, there's something blinking over there. I see that. You see that? Please be a healing herb. Or shotgun shells. It's the key. All I right. shouldn't have taken it. Yeah, you should have. No. Put them jewels in them chicks' busts. I'll put one in there. I, I just want to find, like, a healing item or something. You ain't going to find one. There's nothing. I thought there was a way over this way. Alright, well, let's see how fast I get fucked here. The best we can do is the best we can do, people. If we die here, you don't get mad. Oh, come on, Leonard. You gotta use the onion button. Fits perfectly. Uh, the other one. It was meant to be in there. Uh, what, do you think's, what do you think's in that dude's chest? I don't know. Uh, hopefully... Uh, Shotgun shells and first aid spray? Yeah, exactly. That's what I want. Right? It's gonna be like some bullshit though. Oh, it's gonna be another butt plug. Great. Leonard, for the fuck of fuck. Yeah, king plug. <laughs> that's mine. That, that's how you know it's mine. <laughs> oh, nothing What happened. the hell? I swear to God, a liquor's supposed to fall down. 
Get you there. I guess not. Maybe the game is taking pity on me for being so fucking garbo at it. Let's well, check the map and see right. what and where right. I have and have not been. So I'm pretty sure we've got we've gone everywhere. Oh, there's upstairs. a door down there that I have not been through. Is that you talking about that blue one? I'm talking about the yellow one right there. Oh sure. Well, what's that? What's that blue one over there though? I don't know. Why don't we go find out? I wonder. I wonder if that's signifying, hey, you have that key now. It could. I'm right here, and I can go down here. That sounded like a cheerleader cheer. I'm right here, and I can go down here. I'm right here, and I can go down here. You know, be really dope. Healing items. Yeah. Dope. Is this the? Uh, Correct. Yes. Yes. Okay. There you go. Man, I'm really bamboozled because I thought there was a liquor in that room. I, I very strongly did, and I can't um, imagine having to go back to that room for anything. Yeah. So I wonder if, because I, I used to play, you know, both this one and the Claire one, because once you clear one. You get the the like B option right. for the other for the other character. So I don't know. Maybe maybe it's in the B story, or maybe it's in Claire's story. That's some sweet whiffs. He's not dead. Uh, he might be now. There you go. Get my bullets. I need an onion. No, nope, I do lace. not. Well, you're just gonna have to get real skillful. Oh, where's that hug master? <laughs> I killed him, didn't I? Oh, did you? Pretty sure. Good. Then we don't have to deal with him. Yeah. That's fantastic. Oh, there's oh, a, oh, a oh, oh, oh. Get to the ladder, Leonard. Get there. Come on. Get to the fucking oh! ladder. <laughs> Anyways, as I was saying, Several episodes ago. Oh, we have an unfinished story. I apologize. Uh, Sweet Home. Yes. The NES RPG. Um, Resident Evil 1 started off as a remake of that. Oh, yeah? And, uh, like, it changed into what it is. But, um, they kept the transitions, like, uh, the doors. Because, like, in Sweet Home, you go through a door, it gives you this. Okay. Only the NES version of it. Okay. And it was really cool. It's like a game about a haunted house. You're trying to solve a mystery. <laughs> you use one of your little keys over there. Do I have them on me? I sure as shit do. Oh, there's probably bullets in there, too. I, yeah, I don't think that one's the gun parts. Nicely done. There you go. Some boules. Um... Boule, boule. Sweet home, door animations, NES. I got one. I, I don't. Uh, Get rid of that butt plug. Gonna. Um. Yeah, it was really cool. You're like, you gotta take pictures of these uh, paintings and solve the mystery of the haunting. And it's like for a Nintendo game. It's like really violent. Yeah. And like, yeah, Resident Evil One started off as a remake of that. Are we talking um, NES or Super NES? NES. Okay. It started off as a remake of that because um, they, they, they you know it was a good game. Sure. And it was like traditional RPG combat. Shit, this is where we fought that first liquor. How did you not go in that room? Was it locked? I think it was. Okay. Where is it? Is it right around the corner? Yeah. Alright. It's not the kind of game that I think I can play on the show, though. No? It's the kind of game that you gotta have, like, a, like you gotta sink a couple hours into it. Gotcha. Yeah, I've, I've noticed since I've been doing the show with you that there are, there are games I think we could play on the show, and they, they'd flow really well, and that kind of stuff, but then, then there are games like, um, 
a, a lot of RPGs, like you playing um, Shining Force by yourself, that that's fine because you're doing all the voices and everything, and you're constantly you have you have an energy for RPGs. I feel like if I played RPGs on the show by myself, it'd probably be the same thing. Though we would play a uh, different style RPGs. Um, like right now, I'm playing Dragon Quest XI at home. I just recently finished. Uh, How is that, by the way? Fantastic. I'm. Ha- I. I. Well, I loved Dragon Quest VIII, right? Right. And Dragon Quest XI to me is is very much. Um, you got to find a way to push it. Yeah, I, I got to actually push it. Yeah. I keep pressing the act the X button because I feel like I need to hold it down to push it. All you gotta do is walk into it. Yeah. I've been having a lot of fun with it. Um, I have an 11 month at home. 11 month old child at home so I take it when I can get it and a lot of times I'm playing with the volume down because he's sleeping and stuff like that but everything that I am getting out of it I'm really enjoying it um, definitely worth the $60 I spent to, to get it but um, I don't think RPGs have the energy that our uh Synergy for for talking back and forth. I don't think it has what it what it needs. If that makes sense. Yeah. So. Yeah. Uh, check out that other door next time on Dash Mode Gaming. Or what's I got the crank. You got the crank. Yeah. That. Okay. I got to go up to the crank room. Remember the crank room? Well, remember we got that purple room? Or is that? Yeah, I can't. I can't get oh, in that's there. That's locked. Though. Okay. I got to get up into the crank room. And turn the crank. I don't remember how to get there. But it's fine. Because we can figure that out next time on Dash Mode Gaming. Sounds like a plan. We'll see you then. See you then.